Hello, hello. Welcome back to the Sea Morning Show and our first talk show of the day. We will discuss about the confusions and anxiety that many scholarship applicants may experience mm. in writing personal essay <laughs> or facing interviews. So these issues can actually be resolved with improving your self-knowledge. Yeah, actually self-knowledge can be very, very useful, not yeah. only for applying for a scholarship, applying for a job even yeah. is also very useful. Interacting with other people, having better relationship with other people, actually for our overall success. Yeah. But I know that this time we're gonna focus on applying scholarship, but the knowledge of self-knowledge itself that we will discuss is gonna be useful in general. And that's why we have today joining us the personal growth coach, Hani Satrio, to talk about what is exactly self-knowledge <laughs> and how advantages can it be for our lives. Thank you so much for coming thank here, you, Thank you, thank you. Thank <laughs> you, thank you for having me. Yes, it's a pleasure. Let's talk about self-knowledge, right? This morning, actually, one of our dearest colleagues, Ralfi Nasution, also brought this book, Self-Knowledge, by the School of Life. Ah. And actually, I recommended that mm. to him some, some time ago. But what is exactly self-knowledge? Okay, so this is an umbrella term. Mm. It can be so many different things, but mm. maybe uh, I want to focus on how you understand yourself. How we understand how ourselves. How we understand ourselves. Okay. Uh, and it consists of how how aware are you mm. of what you're thinking of. What we're thinking of. Your feelings. Our feelings. Your body reaction. Ooh. And then even deeper, huh. how you truly are at the deep within. That's a lot of homework, especially yes. to find out who we are within. That. Yes. So how do we do that? How do we do that? Um, it's interesting that actually we can do it in our daily life by live more mindfully first. Mm -hmm. Because if we are very in a rush from one thing to another, and then it's just like everything went by so quickly, Yes. we don't absorb, mm -hmm. and then we don't really feel it, really sense it, and then it's just like that. Give us an example of what we can do in our daily lives between when we're not mindful and when we're mindful. Because as you said earlier, yeah. being mindful of how we feel, what we think, who we are really deep inside is actually going to help us understand ourselves more. Yeah. Give us a daily example. Yes, like now when mm -hmm. we're sitting here, mm -hmm. there's a possibility that your mind is not here, right? Oh yes. Elsewhere. Yes. Maybe groceries, maybe next segment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Or maybe a breakfast. Or maybe a breakfast. <laughs> like or maybe when you have a rough morning and you like uh, repeating uh, the argument you had, mm. like so it's a it's a practice. It's a daily practice to be here and now. Yes. And connect to something that you can feel connect with within you. Mm. So some some people it is more easy to connect with their body. Mm. Go ahead, do that first. That's why people like yoga. Yes. Okay. Yeah, it's a really good practice it because is. Uh, yoga is in our everyday life. Yes, yeah. Yes. Uh, and then uh, maybe some people are more into their feelings. Mm. So now, like, what do I feel? So you okay. ask yourself. Ask yourself. Ask yourself. Okay. Ask yourself. Mm. The funny thing is that we had this discussion at our house last night mm -hmm. discussing about scholarship Aww. with our son. Yes. Because ah, he's uh, year 12 right now. Yes. Oh. Hero. So, yeah, hero. <laughs> and uh, the problem with uh, the issue is uh, he doesn't know mm. what to take. Yeah. Uh, like the majors, in yeah. terms of yes. majors. He has like a couple choices as well. So this is a good topic, like yeah. how to, you know, like to gain more awareness on this. Yes, yeah. Yeah. And in the same time, how do you see a good sign yeah. of having a self uh, a knowledge? knowledge yeah, yeah. yeah. So it's interesting that you really have a concrete experience yeah, now. Just last uh, night. Just I'm last night. Just yeah. 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 Yes. Uh, and and maybe it, it can be harder for parents yeah. because yeah. you kind of want to direct them, but you have to give yeah. space. Yeah. yeah so I'm the combination. Yeah yeah, yes. yeah. 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 Such a good daddy. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so um, I think uh, it kind uh, it it will be different for 18 years old. Mm -hmm. Uh, and maybe 25, 27 years old because yes. uh, their level of maturity, their awareness of their, them, themselves, and also their understanding of the world, how the world works can be different. So first, um, in general, uh, we need to be faithful mm -hmm. to what we know today. Okay. What does that mean? 
because like for 17, 18 years old, maybe what they are like to do now about maybe sports, yeah. games, uh, social media, um, communication. Um, maybe there are a few uh, uh, want to be a scientist, mm. etc. Like me, <laughs> <laughs> years ago. <laughs> uh, and so when we feel that, uh, I think I want to learn this, I want to study this, and then there's a good conviction, there's good... And this is about feeling, are not only about, about thinking. It's about, yeah. Mm -hmm. The early stage, right? In the early stage, mm -hmm. and then uh, there's this, uh, that, that's why we need to ask ourselves, mm. do we really want this? Mm. Is it something that sounds right for us today? Mm. And then we follow that, okay. mm -hmm. and then be mindful when we do that. Right. So whatever happens, whether it is uh, making us more certain to that path, right. or maybe, I think it's, another thing mm. maybe it it needs another thing to combine with right 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 and maybe later on in life it becomes more and more clear what we want to do in life so how do yeah. you uh, get to that you know that goal yeah faster? what questions faster. what questions uh -huh. you should you so because it starts from maybe i like this or maybe i like that yeah. as well so okay how do you progress? so for uh younger people because they are maybe less exposed to the world it is really helpful if you go to take, um, you know, the uh, psychotest. The psychotest, oh. yeah. 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 Uh -huh. yeah. In Bahasa Indonesia, it's minat bakat. Yeah, test minat oh. bakat. Yes, yes, yes. yes, yes. yes. Because the, it really helps them. And the psychologist there mm -mm. is really trained to know, uh, you know, I think if you have this and have this, it's good that you mm. are going to that direction. Okay. Correct, correct. Even for people who are older and then want to go to the... Uh, master degree or yes. even PhD. Yeah. Uh, but if you don't take that kind of test, um, being exposed to different things and then asking yourself, mm -hmm. for example, maybe yes. you have a job A, yes. activity B, yeah. volunteering in C, yeah. and how these all activities mm -mm. resonate with you. Mm -mm. Can you be yourself there? Can you yeah. use what's in you mm -hmm. in that or you feel like you're kind of forced to do that, mm. it's not really comfortable, something like that. Can it like nourish that. you? Really? Can it nourish you? Okay. Are you becoming a better person because of that job of be, or because of that science, um, you know, like a, a discipline? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Uh, and interest matter, interest matter combined with the, is it really needed? Mm. Uh, in the society. Yes. Mm -mm, that's true. That's yeah, true. that's true. Actually, well, I guess again, as you said, uh, each uh, each different age group, each age group is yeah. different. For Hero, for example, because he's still sixteen. He's sixteen. Yeah, oh, 16 oh even. my God! So it's <laughs> Daddy's job to ask him the questions yeah, to help him direct. Yeah, we need to be, have it. more discussion. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, but I think yeah, I agree with uh, with us. You know, who are adults like twenties, thirties, forties, even fifties. The, the exercise or the practice of asking ourselves or yeah. even journaling, journaling really yes. getting into uh, getting to know our feelings mm -hmm. why we like this does it nourish us yes and start so doing on. research right yes, yeah yeah exactly. yeah find more information yeah, so, yeah. Uh, this is before applying for a scholarship right? or even before applying for a job mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so how can we because sometimes we have to write an essay or mm -hmm. we have to write a statement letter. What are the things that you think we should include when we've already done our homework mm -hmm. of, of trying to understand ourselves? Mm -hmm. So, um, yeah, it, different stage of preparation. Yes. If we have, uh, uh, it will be different because if we have a lot of time, we can dig deeper, ask ourselves, and if we have only short amount of time we have to get uh, the essay done and yes. then the interview done so it depends so um, come back to uh, what how how it can how can you use it in your uh, real situation mm -hmm. but the main um, main uh, what is it objective mm -hmm. is mm -hmm. to make sure mm -hmm. that you really know what you are doing okay. you really know what we're doing yes because when you're writing an essay and then later on when you get past the first stage, uh, you will be asked. Yes. And sometimes a lot of people, maybe like three or four people at the same time interviewed you. Yeah. And then if you are sure, I want to take this major in this school, yes. in this country, yes. for this and for that, yeah. 
and given my respective background, what mm. I have been through in my life, not only professionally but also personally. Correct. Yeah. Yes. Because the more personal it is, like I have, uh, I had a, a, a lecturer in my university. I studied in Bandung Institute of Technology. Right. Wow. So smart. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Until today, I still teach biology for um, high school students That's going so to cool. university. Wow. <laughs> I didn't know that. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm really passionate with this discipline, but I have another calling for uh, helping people. So yes. now I'm a personal growth coach. So my lecturer said um, her interest for science came from uh, a banana vendor seller uh -huh. around uh, her house. Right. Um, sometimes uh, it get bad. The banana get bad because uh, no one buys it. Yes. And then. So many years later, mm. she becomes a scientist that found um, a gene to stop the ripening process. Wow. What? So it comes from curiosity and passion, and also and then she studies it. And also, uh, you know, it, 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 she feels pity for uh, the vendor. Yes. Oh, she cannot. Uh, he cannot sell the the banana and right. what to do. So. It can be that kind of personal, right. and I believe everyone, especially the one that wants to go further in their academic process, yeah. it's not easy, right? Yeah. Studying abroad, I know that both of you have that experience. Yes. So, if you know why, the why, and then it's really clear for you, and then it's matter how to express it. You have chat GPT now. <laughs> yeah, which yeah. is a disaster, by the way, for <laughs> essay writing. <laughs> Hi. Yeah, go on. Sorry. Yes, yes. But that clarity, ChatGPT cannot give no. you. You yes. have to find it yourself, and then maybe it's really helpful to be able to talk to someone uh, more experienced or uh, even professional help, like counselor, coach, mm -hmm. to verify your why. Yeah, yeah. To know the why, because you're right, honey. Because ChatGPT may 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 have this ability to uh, help you pass the first uh, step, which first is step. probably yeah, like yeah, essay yeah. writing, step. if you give the right prompt, by yeah, the way. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but then in the interview, you cannot lie. Of course. Because yeah. people will be yeah. able to sense whether what you write is actually reflective of how you are and who you are and what you want. That's yeah. why interview is important. Yeah, it is super. That's the main one. Exactly, it's <laughs> super important. Okay, well, thank you. Thank you I so guess, much. thank you so much, honey, for this. Thank mm -hmm. you, thank you. Get to know yourself first, and then you write your application uh, based on the knowledge that you have on yourself. Ask yourself, why do I want to do this? Why do I want to apply for the scholarship? Why do I want to study? Why do I want, why do I want, and so many other <laughs> Why do we want to take this major? Exactly. Yeah. There All right. Go. Thank you so thank much, you, honey. honey. Thank, thank you. you so thank much. you. <laughs> thank you so <laughs> thank much. You. Thank you. Yes, we're going to go for a break. In the meantime, you can stay connected with us at C Today News on Instagram, X, and YouTube. We'll be right back with another insightful discussion.